Well, we got Justin Bieber at number five. Number six, rather, was Sorry. Up one from number six on my fantasy playlist, January 10th, 2016. Justin Bieber, he's had his share of it first day. Boy, he had astounding success. Late 2000s, early 20-teens, all the teenage girls, and even some of the real young ones are screaming at him. And uh, even heard an infant actually bawling for Justin Bieber. It was just a piece of it I heard on on the gosh, on a radio station, God, about 10 years ago, I think. But he's had his share of adversity. Reckless driving, urinating in public. He adopted a baby monkey illegally on the black market. He bought it. But uh, had to, uh, well, had to relinquish it. He was accused of abusing it or neglecting the monkey. Well, anyway, he was contrived by 2015. And he even, even allowed himself to get roasted a Comedy Central. But the song Sorry, though, doesn't really, it's not about atoning for his past sins. It's about a girlfriend or an ex-girlfriend. It might have been about Selena Gomez. I know he was going out with her for a while. And, uh, gosh, you know something? I read, oh, God, about 2011 or 2012. It was a pretty harsh article about Justin Bieber. Someone was speculating that Justin Bieber, this was when he was at a low point now. Someone had speculated that Justin Bieber was going to wind up as just pumping gas, a gas station attendant, an ex-washed-up pop star pumping gas. I mean, well, that's highly unlikely. He's made a rousing comeback with this record. The beat, the house beat on this record, supplied by, I can't pronounce his name. I got him on one of my fantasy playlists, though. Skill Lex. Skill Lex, I believe is how you pronounce it. Justin Bieber, Justin Bieber really liked, liked his production style. Um, the lyrics of this record was written by Julia Michaels and Justin Tranter. They got together, got together in a room. And they wrote the song in about less than an hour. But in the original version of the song, they incorporated some stuttering, which the record company did not like. Thus, they rewrote the song. And they rewrote it. They wrote it about less than an hour, maybe about an hour. And that was it. Justin Tranter and Julia Michaels, they went out to dinner, and three weeks later, the song was put out as a single, and it was a smash. The streams, 4.38 streams, online streams, I'm talking about 4 billion. He's not going to be a gas station attendant. There's no way. I can't see that. Not with 4.38 billion streams. That was the highest streaming until it was broken by Despacito, and that song garnered 4.6 billion streams. Very successful record. Sorry about Justin Bieber making a big comeback. Up on my fancy playlist, the number six on my fancy, well, up to number six on my fancy playlist, January 10th, 2016.